My name is Dan and my tutorials are intended to give Ace Money users some quick tips for getting started with the Ace Money Personal Finance Manager. I sincerely trust this tutorial is useful to individuals that are looking for a simple, affordable, and very well supported money management platform. This tutorial will cover setting up a basic single checking account with the ability to download financial data directly from your online banking source. Let's get started. The first icon viewed on Ace Money is the home page icon, which by default lands or opens on your accounts page, which is also accessible by clicking on this icon. You can actually change your home icon to open on any section of Ace Money that you desire. More on this in just a few minutes. The account page is where all your accounts are listed. By clicking on the accounts page icon, you will enter this section. This page is primarily used to switch from one account to another. In this video, we are going to keep everything very simple and use one checking account with a starting balance of $2,000. I'm going to go ahead and click the new account icon and name my account Ace Money Banking Demo. I am then going to choose my account type from the account group drop down list. I'm going to choose bank accounts because this tutorial is based on just that, a single checking account. I'm going to then choose my bank name from the bank drop down list. I am then going to enter my account number. Now I'm going to enter my beginning balance which will be $2,000. Okay, now I'm going to click on the online setup button. In this section, I am first going to check the download transactions for this account box. I am then going to select bank as my online service type. This field has already been filled based on the info that was supplied on the previous screen. You now want to enter your online user ID and password for your online bank account. For this tutorial, I will use Ace Money Man as a user ID and 1234567 as a password. We are now going to click the OK button twice and we now have an account set up that includes the ability to connect and access your online checking account which includes the ability to download transactions. Obviously to add additional accounts all you do is click the new account button. All your accounts will always show on this page. We are now going to enter the account by clicking on the account name. This is your registry. Your registry is a main area of activity and it shows you what is currently happening with the account you have entered. If you have more than one account, obviously each account will have its own independent registry. Here is a tip. After you have created your first account, go to the options section which is found in the tools drop down menu at the top of your Ace Money program. At the very top of the options section, you will notice it says home page. This is where you can change your default landing for your home icon to anything you like. I recommend changing this to your main checking accounts registry page. To do this just click here and select favorite account and then choose your main account which is in the secondary list. I only have one account so obviously this will be my selection. After doing this click the OK button and you are done. Take a look at what happens when you now click on your home page icon. You are now landing on your main checking registry located in your favorite account. You will find this very useful as you start using Ace Money. Now you have only one icon to access your accounts page and your home icon is landing on your most active area. That is it for this tutorial. Have a great day or evening wherever you are in this big world.